Hello, this is Kathleen McKee of Olean's.com Machine Embroidery Art. Lesson 16, Working with Small Text. One of the most difficult things for any embroidery digitizer to do is to make small text legible. Luckily for owners of PE Design Next, they have a new text tool to create very small text. I'm going to populate some text here. And that is about as small as you can get and still have your text legible. Now you may think you can use this tool, the regular tool, and shrink it up And let's shrink it up to fit the same, to be about the same size as our other text. And I'm going to get it and so you can see it a bit better. Now you may think that this is going to sew out well because, gee, it looks great on the screen. And let's look at the realistic preview. Oh, even better. I said, oh, that's way better. We can make that a little sm smaller and make it exactly the same size, pretty much. And Oh, yeah, you think that's going to sew out great. But let me <laughs> assure you, it will not. Number one, if you click on the new text we put on and we go to Sewing Attributes, you can see the density is way, way too dense. Those stitches are so close together, you're going to break your thread about every 20, 30 stitches. Another thing, as we had mentioned in earlier lessons, is that a stitch has to be at least one millimeter in length. Otherwise, the needle's practically falling on top of itself, causing a thread breakage and uh, putting holes in your fabric. So let's measure these stitches. I'm going to get my measure tool from my quick access bar. And if you remember looking down in the lower left hand corner, look, keep your eye in that lower left hand corner as I click on the start of one stitch, drag it to the next one, and looking below in that lower left hand corner, I can see it's 0.5 millimeters in length. That is nowhere near long enough to have a legible text.